Hi, I'm Ashley Fleming, Practice Manager of Madden Financial Advisors. I'm here today talking to Mark Madden, Private Client Advisor, about what is financial planning. So Mark, tell me a little bit about financial planning. Sure. Like any good plan, we need to determine exactly where we're going and what are the resources we're working with. In financial planning, we call that the fact-finding process. We sit down with the client and understand all of the goals and objectives that they've got. We try and take a look at all assets, liabilities, cash flow and the personal details and marry them up to give them a financial strategy to get them to where they're wanting to go. Once we've produced this, and we call that a financial plan, we bring the client back for presentation, determine action items, and subsequently we put together a review cycle to ensure that we can update and manage that plan on an ongoing basis. Okay, I understand that you're an independent financial advisor. Why would I choose you over any other advisor? The sense of being an independent advisor is very important for us. Independence states that our ownership structure is such that we own ourselves, so we're not owned by a bank or insurance company. The real question is about licensing. Whoever owns the license dictates what products you're allowed to talk about. In our case, the advantage of being an independent advisor means that the client will receive advice specific to them and we don't have to put them in a particular superannuation insurance product or platform. And what sort of services do you offer? We're a holistic financial planning firm, so the services we offer range from accumulation to protection to succession strategies. We look at direct shares, managed funds, dollar cost averaging, and a whole series of other strategies to help somebody build wealth and then hopefully minimise tax along the way, in conjunction with our inline accountants. From a wealth protection point of view, we cover a range of personal insurances, including life cover, total permanent disability, income protection, and trauma or critical illness. In the cases of all these, people need to make sure that as they're building wealth, they're doing it in accordance with what their current situation is and hopefully what they plan it will be. It's not always the way it'll be. Somebody may lose their job, somebody may pass away, all sorts of things can happen. So we need to make sure that we're protecting that strategy we're putting in place. The last part is we put a lot of time and effort also into estate planning, which is really about wealth succession. First, we need to build it, then we need to protect it. The last part is to make sure it does in fact get to the loved ones we want it to get to at the end of the day. So tell me some questions I should ask when I'm seeing a financial advisor. Absolutely. You should ask them how they're remunerated. Is it actually fee for service? Do they receive trails, kickbacks and soft dollar commissions? In our case, it's one of the first points I hit with clients always about our remuneration structure. We do charge the client, we have no problem with that. We do not accept soft dollar commissions, trails or soft dollar incentives like Formula One tickets or tickets to the tennis and so forth. Another question would be is who does own the license? Because that will in fact guide what they are about to talk to you about. And a third point would be, do they adhere to a governing set of ethical principles? For example, are they members of the AFA, the FPA, the Association of Independently Owned Financial Planners or any other bodies? In our case, we're members of all of the above. Okay Mark, now I've found you, where do we go from here? The next stage from here would be to sit down and have an obligation free meeting, which is done at our cost. In that meeting we'd explore your personal goals and objectives and your financial information and we'd create a strategy going forward to putting a plan in place. Thanks Mark. If you need any more information, please feel free to contact us on 03 7200 or feel free to go to our website www.maddenfinancial.com.au. Thank you.